This is how I make a beef hot pot broth. In three and a half pound beef bone to make the broth. And I boil water. I put one spoon of salt. I let it boil for like two minutes to blanch them. Rinse them in cold water. And Tanya rinse all the residue out. See, it's nice and clean like that. Gallon of water and I dunk it in here. And I'm putting salt. Two teaspoons of salt. Now I'm cutting the onion to char them. Onion and ginger. To broil. You put it very close to the heat. You see how close I put to the heat? Broil them about five minutes or so. Ginger and onion is done. I will put that in my soup. So now, after the water boil like that already, I'm gonna turn the heat to very low to have that simmer and I will add two teaspoons of sugar and close the lid for three to four hours. Now the broth is already done and now I'm mixing the paste ingredient. I'm using the crab Mint crab in spices. This is the texture. You could buy that or you can use this brand. Crab paste with soya bean oil formula too. I'm using two tablespoons of that. And now I'm using the tom yum paste. This is what it looks like. It, I'm using about four, I mean four tablespoons. Four tablespoon. The Sanya bin herb sauce. Four tablespoon spicy chili oil optional if you don't eat spicy you don't need to put chili in everyone heat tolerant are different so I'm putting that much in or you could use fresh jalapeno 
or ch any kind of chili that you prefer. I'm using coconut water. Two cup, sixteen ounce. One tablespoon of fish sauce. You can use any brand you want. Some people like it more spicy, some people more salty, some people more sweet. So just adjust to however you like. Now I'm going to pour the beef broth. Look at that. Beautiful color. Okay. Now I'm going to scoop that. I'm going to do one more bowl of that. Add the unsweetened coconut milk, about 8 ounce or so if you like your soup okay. to be a little creamy. It's supposed to taste a little um, salty, a little sweet, a little spicy. Green onion and cilantro. Now the soup is done. Turn the heat on, bring it to boil when you're ready to put the hot pot food in. Now I'm making a side dipping sauce. I'm using spicy chili crisps and soy bean curb sauce. to have a little jalapeno Chop that. and some green onion cilantro that's my side dipping sauce all these veggie Protein and noodles are ideal for hot pot. Any kind of vegetable you want, meatball, any kind, any kind of protein, any kind of noodle. Thank you for watching till the end. Any questions, just comment below. And if you find my video is helpful, please like and subscribe. Thank you.